Two parents, both of them doctors, with four boys between the ages of five and ten. The COVID vaccine can't come soon enough. I think I will just have a huge sense of relief, just relief for them to have them as best protected as we can be. Mom is a family doctor. Dad works in intensive care and has been treating COVID patients since the beginning, which has led to blunt talk about vaccines. We don't hold back when we're talking about with our kids about these things, and, and they've seen the evolution over the last 18 months. They've, they've heard from me the suffering and death that, that I've seen at work uh, that's caused by COVID. The message took, the boys are keen to get jabbed. I'm a big baby with needles, but I am really excited to get the COVID vaccine. Now we'll be able to go to new places. Not just because of what mom and dad see at work, they miss being kids. I was signed up for a season of baseball on Leo's team. It would have been the only year, but then COVID came and stopped it. I'm really sad because I was looking forward to playing baseball with Nate. In the U.S., more than two and a half million kids have had their first shot of Pfizer so far. Friday's approval for Canada comes after several weeks where the highest incidence rates have been in kids under 12. They're pretty excited uh, to get the poke and to get going. Of course, the day of when it's actually their turn, I'm sure we'll have, you know, a little bit of hesitancy and a little bit of fear from them, uh, but that's to be expected. Federal officials are now working with Pfizer to lock down a firm delivery schedule for 2.9 million doses, enough for every kid between 5 and 11 to get their first shot. Federal sources say deliveries could start early next week, then it's up to the provinces to get doses in arms. David Cochran, CBC News, Ottawa.